Ding-dong. Come on in. Hi, Molly. Oh, hi, Marie Grace. How are you? I'm fine. Is Grace... Yes, Grace is home. She's in our room. Do you remember where it is? Yeah, I do. Okay. Have fun. Oh, before I forget, I invited another friend over. Is that okay? Well, does um, Grace know her? No, I just met this girl. I thought it'd be great if me and Grace and my friend would hang out together. Well, I suppose it'll be okay as long as she's not in any trouble. She's not. She's one of the sweetest girls you'll ever meet. Okay. Well, thank you for telling me. Why isn't she with you? She couldn't come right away with me because um, she had a dentist appointment, but she should be here soon. I gave her mother the address. Okay. All right, honey. Um, Go see Grace. Does Grace know you have a friend coming? No, I'm going to tell her. Do you think she would mind? I don't think she would mind. She's not the type to get jealous. <laughs> okay. Um, so, go, so go hang out with Grace and call if you need anything. I will. Thanks. Man. Hey. Hey, M M Marie Grace. Hey. I didn't know you were coming over. Well, I thought I'd surprise you. And I have another surprise, too. What is it? See, I made a new friend. Oh, you did? Yeah. Her name's Emily, and she's a really sweet girl. She, um, she's coming over to meet you. Does my mom know about this? Yeah, I just talked to her and she said it was fine. Is it okay with you? Sure, I guess. I mean, if you say she's a good person, then she must be. I trust your judgment. Thanks. <laughs> you like her. So how did you guys meet? Uh, she just moved in across the street from me. I thought you always had neighbors across the street. Well, I did, but they moved away, and a new family took it right away. Well, that's cool. Um, is she our age? Yeah, she's 13. That's a little younger than us. I know, but she, um, she's very nice, though, and she's not at all immature. Well, I didn't think she would be. Do you think Krista would get along with her? That I, would, I wouldn't know. I don't know your sister that well. You know your sister better than I do. I know. It's just that I've never met Emily. And you've seen Chris a couple times. I thought maybe you would have an idea of how she would react. Nope. Oh, that must be her. Come on in. Hi. Hey, Emily. Did your mom find the place okay? Yeah. Hi, you must be Grace. Yeah, hi, you must be Emily. Yeah. Um, so what are you guys doing? Oh, we were just go about to go on YouTube. What's YouTube? You don't know what YouTube is? Well, Emily's family doesn't have computers. Her family doesn't have much money. Oh. Well, YouTube is some is a website on a computer where we can watch videos for free. That's awesome, really? Can we watch movies? Some movies we can. YouTube doesn't have every single show or movie on there, but it has a lot. It also has doll videos on it, and it has all kinds of things on YouTube. Do you want to check it out? I'd love to. Uh, where can I sit? Sit next to Marie Grace. Here. Hand this to Emily so she could see. Uh, okay. So you guys having a good time on YouTube? Yeah, these, this is really cool. I gotta come here more often. You don't have to, Emily. I have a computer too at home and we have the internet and YouTube and everything. 
So you could always come to my house and go on the computer. That would be so cool, and it'll be so much easier to get to your house and here because because all I would have to do is cross the street to go to your house. Exactly. We're going to be good friends. Yeah. Yeah, you guys are going to be great friends. Really great friends. So I guess you don't need me. Hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. What do you mean by that? Well, you guys seem to be really good friends. I'm happy for you. You don't sound happy. Did I do something wrong? If you can't figure out what you did wrong, Mary Grace, maybe we weren't meant to be friends. Grace, what is your problem? Well, if you don't know, I'm not going to tell you. Figure it out for yourself. Come on, Emily, let's go. I don't think Grace wants to hang out with us. I'm coming. <sighs> Look, I didn't mean to cause trouble between you and Mary Grace. It's a little late for that. Just go. Go with your friend. Who is it? It's your mother. Come in. Grace, honey? Yeah? What happened between you and your friends? They're not my friends. I don't want to hear that talk. You and Marie Grace seem to be getting along fine. Well, not anymore. She's better friends with Emily than with me. Now, how do you know that? Hmm? Because of whole time they were here, they paid attention to each other and barely talked to me. And what made things worse was that Emily and Mary Grace arranged to hang out together more often just because they live closer together. It's like they wanted to, to get to me. Do you think Marie Grace is like that? I don't know any, I don't know anymore. I mean, I've been friends with Marie Grace for just a week, so how would I know? Well, then what are you so angry about if you've only known her for a week? Because I thought we would be really good friends, but I guess not. Honey, just because Marie Grace has a friend doesn't mean she's not your friend. You should be old enough to know that. Yeah, well, call me a baby because I don't know it. I just wish that I never let Mary Grace bring a friend over. I wish you hadn't either. Don't be blaming this on me, honey. I didn't know this would cause a problem between you and Marie Grace. Well, it did. <sighs> I don't know what to do. I think you should call Marie Grace and apologize. Me? Apologize for what? I think you're a little jealous. I am not jealous. I think you are. You just don't realize it. Mom, just leave me alone, okay? Fine. I'll give you some time to yourself. Just think about what I said. Am I really that jealous? I better go ask Chris. Uh, she may be younger than me, but she gives great advice. <sighs> Come on. Hey. Hey. Are you okay? Not really. Well, I heard yelling a little while ago. Did you and Movie Grace have a fight? Yeah. Well, sit down and tell me about it. Why are you acting so civil toward me? You don't even like Movie Grace that much. Because I know you like her. And you're my sister, so... If something's bothering you, I gotta be there for you. Just like you gotta be there for me. Thanks. Tell me what happened. 
Well, maybe Grace invited a friend over, and at first things were going okay. Alright, so what happened? Well, then, Marie, Grace, and Emily started to talk as if I wasn't even there. And then to make things worse, right in front of me, Marie, Grace says, You know, Emily, you and I gotta hang out by ourselves once in a while because we live closer together. It's like she was trying to get to me. I can understand how that, that you would feel that way. But are you sure it's not just jealousy that's making you feel that way too? Just a little bit? You sound like mom. Well, maybe she's right. I mean, I know you and Marie Grace became close after a week of knowing each other, but you've still only known each other for a week. What does that have to do with anything? It just means that Marie Grace has had other friends before she met you. Maybe that's why she's so close to Emily. No, she didn't know Emily before she knew me because Emily had just moved across the street from her a week ago. So she's based, so Marie Grace has basically known both of us around the same time. So how did you wind up fighting? I already told you. Oh, you mean when they talked about hanging by themselves? Yeah. It hurt my feelings. Well, why are you telling me this? Why don't you call Marie Grace, invite her over, and talk to her calmly and rationally and tell her how you feel? I don't think she's aware of how you feel. Well, I told her that you might as well be, she might as well be friends with Emily and not be friends with me. Is that what you want? No, I don't. I want to be friends with Mary Grace, and I want to get to know Emily better. Well, don't tell me. Tell Mary Grace. Give her a call. Okay. Thanks, Krista. Don't mention it. I hope she can pull this off. Come on. Hey, hey, you didn't bring Emily with you. I didn't think you wanted her to come. So what do you need? Um, sit down. What I need is to talk to you. So what's up? I want to apologize for being, what, obnoxious, jealous, angry? Yeah. All the above. I'm sorry. I just, it's just that I like you a lot and I was afraid Emily was taking you away from me. Especially when you and her discussed hanging out more often than me and you just because you lived closer together. It kind of hurt my feelings. I didn't mean to hurt your feelings and I guess I shouldn't have said those things in front of you. I'm sorry, but just because I have other friends doesn't mean that I'm not friends with you. You should know, you should know that. I know I should know that, but I don't. Even though people have taught me that, I haven't learned it yet. <laughs> it's okay, people try to teach me things that I haven't learned yet either. But look, you're always going to be my friend. Thanks. I'll tell you what, how about on Saturday, you and I could have a sleepover, if it's okay with our parents. Just you and me. We can invite Emily, too. I don't have to invite her. No, I want you to. I want to get to know her. Okay, I'll ask her. But are you sure about this? I'm positive. Okay. Well, look, I have to go. My mom's waiting in the car. I told her I'd only be, for a few, be here a few minutes. Okay, call me tonight. I will. Okay, bye. Bye. <sighs> <sighs> I'm so relieved.